It was the first day back in person in over a year. Students were excited to be back. But little did they expect a school-wide controversy would happen. So the idea was for the opening day assembly to be outside at Sailor Stadium. However, as we looked at the weather, we knew that we were going to have to come up with a plan B. Plan B was to have the senior class in the Sailor Center and all the underclassmen in their classrooms watching via live stream. Very early in the day, we found out we had to go with plan B. I just thought it was going to be like a fun assembly. I don't know where we could all be together. Obviously, I thought it was going to be a fair race. Yeah, I was very excited, obviously. I thought I had a good chance of winning. It's always fun to participate in a school assembly, especially on the first day. I just like a competition. Yeah, I knew I was pretty fast at speed walking, so I know there was a good chance that I could have won, and it was just something fun to do. Grace, she's super athletic, has long legs, good at speed walking. The cards are stacking up for us to win. I need an Ethernet connection in order to live stream from Sailor Center. At the time, we realized that the Ethernet connection was broken, but as I've had time to reflect, I realize it may very well have been tampered with. Somebody did not want the rest of the school to see that assembly. Um, well, we, um, we came up with some, um, some ideas, and you know, uh, Mr. Morales, you know, he really thought it would be a good idea to do the Olympics because um, he was a college athlete and uh, he never made it to the Olympics, but we just thought it would be kind of cool to, to recreate that. Oh, I had, I had nothing, absolutely nothing to do with that. Um, you know, uh, Mr. Drossi came down and then I saw um, him and Mr. Morales trying to figure it out and they were, you know, connecting some wires and uh, it looked to me like they had it all under control. Do you know if any tech was tampered with? Oh, I, I, I can't believe that it would be. I mean, there would be no reason for anyone to do that, um, you know. They weren't trying to cover anything up or anything. Oh, I just think it was, uh, you know, it was a good, good victory. He had, he had told me that he trained for a long time for it, and uh, you know, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. He did a good job. You know, he supplied all the, all the um, batons, and uh, you know, just made sure that it was a fair, fair race. Is this going to be? Is this gonna, like? Is this on the record? Oh, Mr. Morales, Mr. Morales. Uh, uh, sorry, boys. I gotta. Uh, we want to talk to you about the assembly. Yeah, I, uh, I gotta. I gotta. I gotta no, uh, class. come here. No, uh, you know. Uh, sorry, not right now. We really need to talk to you. <laughs> After numerous attempts of reaching out, Mr. Morales refused to comment on the situation. The official line from Motor Shores High School is we will neither confirm nor deny that anyone was the winner of that race. Who do you think crossed the finish line first? Me. 